think a good connection, tangible connection point is that when we talk about accountability, people's minds usually go to, do you have a checklist? Is it done? Are you accountable to that? Did you get it done? However, there's like a huge part of accountability, which is usually like the relational, the people-y parts that there's not a lot of time space for. It's the least understood. When organizations talk about accountability, they don't often think about the experiences, the behaviors that are happening. It's separate. So I feel like we're moving to this place of expanding people's understanding of accountability. But mm -hmm. I'd really like to start there and be very clear before we even get into intent and impact. When we're saying accountability, what are we talking about? I'm, t I'm trying my best to give like some words to it. And you're very good at you do magical things with words. <laughs> what is your understanding of accountability? Let's start there. I think my understanding is accountability is taking ownership and being responsible for my impact and for, I think my impact, I, I cause things to happen and there are consequences and we all do that in our actions. And so I think accountability is being responsible and owning that there's, and I think that's the basic definition, but then a deeper definition or another aspect of it is understanding that those consequences, like you need to be responsible for those also, good and bad. <laughs> I, I think so often we think of accountability in the workplace and you employee are accountable when you don't get your work done and this is the impact on the yeah. business. But that's narrow-sighted because I think of it in terms of community. There's a communal impact. And it's not just employee who doesn't get work done. It's also supervisor. <laughs> how did, how do, have you reflected on your role in this happening? So it's not quite yeah. as black and white for me as I yeah. think yeah. we experience it in the workplace. Yes, yeah. I'm glad you actually said community because I keep thinking about the circle. There's there's a closing of a loop aspect of accountability for me. There's things that are happening, there's impact, and then there's an accountability to a, well, a shared resolution mm -hmm. or a mutually understood beneficial healthy resolution that usually gets left behind. Because mm -hmm. if people get to the point where there's an acknowledgement that something has occurred, there's not as much understanding of what to do once that happens. It's okay. I, I acknowledge it. It didn't go well. And it's almost like crickets because it was so hard for people to get to that right. point. Well, that's a great point. And then another part of accountability is the repair, reform, the conversation about let's close it. And I don't mean close like it's done, but a full circle loop is what I yeah. mean. And then you check back in. And I just really love this concept of that circle because that is an accountability cycle to me. I, I, lo I, love, that. I love that. 